So, over the years, we produced thousands of paternity stories. Some of the men deny babies because of the child's physical features or the color of their skin. My next guest, Imani, accuses her husband, Golub, of denying their two-year-old son, Issa, because, because of religion. You see, Golub is Muslim. Imani is not Muslim. Imani says from the moment she met Golub's family, they did not accept her. So much so that she claims they have brainwashed Golub into denying their child. Now, these are serious accusations. Mari, his family has a very high standard for their religion, which I understand, and they, they believe that you're supposed to honor your mother That's and true. father, right? But he needs to honor me as his wife and honor my son as well. So as background, I mean, your relationship, I mean, it was fast. You know, we were dating for about 10 months. He told me, okay, look, we could either stay together, date secretly, but we're fornicating. My parents don't like that. My family doesn't respect what we're they doing. They believe you should be married. Yes, so we, I agreed. I said, okay, let's get married. Let's do the ceremony. I agreed to the Is ceremony. Is this after or before you were pregnant? Way before. So we did the ceremony. Oh. All right. We got married, and then, his parents, when are you gonna have a baby? 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 Every day after we got married. So two months after we got married, I got pregnant. We had Issa. Right. We were fine. It, until? Oh, that's not his baby. Oh, this. Oh. oh. Oh, his hairline is receding. He looks like your ex. Oh, your ch Let me show you my baby, Maury. Let me show you my baby. Apparently now, with his family in his ear all the time, it's just, yeah, he's never... Yeah, his brother Jabril apparently has a lot to say, so you can oh. go ahead and bring him out now, oh, because... Jabril. Oh. Jabril apparently knows a lot yeah, about you. Yeah, look at you. him. Like, what? He's a child. He's a child. He doesn't know nothing about marriage, nothing about nothing. What does he tell your husband? Oh, he thinks I'm a hoe. I'm a cheater. Um, they tell him, oh, because I'm pretty, that I could, you know, get whoever I want. So what it's ridiculous. What about the group text that members of his family oh, created? Yeah. What so, was that all about? A family member decided to put my ex, my son, and Gollop in a pit collage. Oh, wow. And send it out. So now they think your son looks like an ex. Oh, my God. That has nothing to do with completely irrelevant with my son. They look just alike. Like, identical. It's like a copy and paste of Golub to Issa. Right. Does Golub bring this up to you all the time? All the time. He tells really? me I'll never be good enough. Do I don't... you think that at, once you give him these DNA tests and it and Oh, show... I can't wait. I'm gonna laugh. I'm gonna... Oh, his, his family, they should, they should be embarrassed of themselves. Everybody, here's your husband, Golub. Golub, come on out. He looks he, nothing he looks like me. He just like you. He don't he have looks a nothing hair like me, Mari. He's a baby. Nothing at he's all. That baby. baby does not he's like, a baby. He does you not resemble stupid. me at You're all. Stupid. My smile and everything does not stupid. resemble me. Are you he's serious? Stupid. Stupid. He looks Donna. nothing like me. That Donna. baby looks nothing Donna. like me. Is this you talking or your family? His talk? family. His family. My, it's, he's it's, a he's a hit. No. I feel like his my family. Mari, listen. I I feel like my family have influenced me to some point, but I feel like this is part of my how I feel as well. Eventually, as he grew up, is it about looks? I feel like it's, it's re, he doesn't resemble Maury. me. I feel like it's more about looks, you know. Mari, I went I, through his phone. No, and in, I, his, I think, and in his in his search log, he had DNA testing nearby. Oh. I confronted him about it. When I confronted him about it, he told me I was gonna take Issa and go get a that DNA test behind your back. So that's when I took it upon myself. I'm like, Mari. okay, you know what? You want a DNA test? You'll get one, but it's gonna be on national TV. Yeah. 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 
What did your brother tell you? He was a big influencer uh, to, to me as well, because he was along one of the family members that made the pick art, uh, that performed, that oh, showed. Oh, yeah, with the ex? A yes, whole that, joke, show, that whole showed joke. that my baby resembled joke. more of my ex. No. You well, know? wait a second. No. Your parents. No. more of her ex. Uh, her ex. Apparently, apparently, Gollum. They're just when, mad when, because when you I'm all not got, Muslim. When you all got married, yes. your family encouraged her to get pregnant, right? They did. It is. That's part of my religion is, is that when, when, they have, when you have the baby, uh, when you get married, you're supposed to, you know, supposed you're to supposed reproduce. To yeah, yeah, yeah but they knew I wasn't Muslim, and they knew that we were so fresh. You they that. didn't give me time. Yes, time, I understood that, and I agreed to the ceremony. Yes, we did. With time. With time, Golub. Everything no, was we so agreed rushed, at that and then you're sitting, we you gonna... asked for this. I did not ask for this. I asked for this. I did not I asked for this. I asked. This is what he had to say, Imani, to my producers about you. I don't think my brother is the father of Imani's baby. Imani is fake, sneaky, and she's shady. And she's not a good enough wife for my brother Gala. We were raised in a Muslim faith and we don't deal with liars and cheaters. Imani knows she cheated on my brother with her ex. And then she found out she was pregnant and tried to pin the baby on my brother. Her son, Issa, looks just like her ex. After all Imani put my brother through, she bought a hope this is his baby. Or she's going to have to answer to our entire family. Everybody, here's the girl. You think he's too young? He's he's 18 more. He just turned. What does he, he know? What does he know about marriage? He knows enough. He knows enough. What does he know about me? He don't Are know me. They don't know me. All right, now I want to talk to the girl. You talk to your brother, right? Yes. You don't think he's the father of that little no, boy? No, I do not. Why don't you? So me and my family, we went back and looked at pictures of her ex, and we put picture together with Issa and him, and they look exactly alike. Let me show y'all again, since you don't get. They look just. Is one of the reasons you're against her because she is not of your religion. That could be one of the reasons, but what she's just a cheater. She just to do? Your brother she's chose me. She not... chose me no, at the end of the day. No, no, no. Because I am not Muslim, she have nothing to do. He chose me. He chose me. And your parents, they they married us, Maury. They pay for the wedding. Ooh. They pay for the wedding. So if you do not respect me, why let me marry your son? Come on. You want to be the father, don't you? Yeah. I do. I want. You well, want him to be the yeah. father, don't you? I really you? hope it's Dallas' baby. Now, yes. I, I, I've got to ask the two of you. You know your family, right? Will they be accepting of her if he's the father of this little boy? I'm pretty confident yes, that they'll be crazy. accepting. That's the only thing I feel like. There's a barrier that's always, you know, that holds us back. In the case of two-year-old Issa, Golub, you are the father. <laughs> Thanks for watching this dramatic DNA reveal. If you want to see more paternity stories, click here. And be sure to subscribe to be the first to know about all new DNA drama.